you just get the lightest shade in the concealer that could be used as an eye primer because the color payoff would like it would be bomb if you get a really light concealer and use it as your base for eyeshadows um, it depends on what type of look that you're doing like a bright look or something like this or a neutral look. Neutral looks, I would rather use concealer rather not and not this primer. But this primer I'm definitely gonna use because I want the best color payoff. My dumbass forgot a mirror, so I'm gonna use my palette mirror. I hate myself so much. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start to draw out that shape. It's like a it's basically a cut crease. Not that hard for me, but it might be hard for some of you, so I'm gonna go slow. I'm gonna start by closing my eyes. And I'm going to pat my concealer, the primer right there. And then I'm going to look up. And then now you can see the outline of where I need to draw the crease, I guess. So this is extends outward like a lot so I'm gonna go past my eyebrow just a little bit like that and yeah that's pretty much yeah okay and then I'm just gonna start bringing this downwards so it meets the corner of my eye like that and then I'm going to start to apply some primer down here as well. And getting it in my inner corner as well. I'm just like looking back and forth at the picture just to make sure I have this shape like down pack like perfectly. Okay, so this is basically the shape that you want. And now I'm just gonna fill in all of this empty space. So we have a perfect base for those eyeshadows to go on top of. If you go over like the crease, I guess, it's fine because rhinestones are gonna cover it anyway. So yeah, this picture is brighter than it should be. Like it's super saturated, so this isn't really the true color. So, but I'm still gonna mimic the brightness of this color, if you know what I mean. So I'm gonna try my best to mimic the color. So I'm gonna start packing on this color. I'm gonna take this color, it's called Jaded from the Milani palette and I'm gonna pack it on to a shader brush and then I'm going to, la 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 la, I'm just gonna pack it on to my shader brush first just to see, it's a good color, okay. Then I'm gonna mix this color, this is the color that I'm gonna use and just pack it onto the end of this eye wing. I'm gonna take this shade from the palette mint julep and I'm gonna just pack it on top of this just to lighten this green a little bit pack on mint julep as well I'm gonna start packing that on and just you know
And then I'm gonna go back into the Milani palette and I'm gonna keep using mint julep, that like really pale green. And I'm just gonna start just packing this one on in the inner part of this look. Um, right at the end, I'm gonna start deepening the color up more. I don't want it to be so like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's a little not dimensional. And I want to have it like as dark as possible at the very end, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take that steep, this one. I'm going to take a blue eyeshadow like this and just like dust over it because I feel like this is so green and it's not the right teal that I want so I'm just gonna dust over it and kind of get this teal that I want yeah this is a lot better I don't know if you can see like but that really transformed this green into like a better type of like teal color. Anastasia single eyeshadow. I'm gonna take this one. This is in the shade aqua. I'm gonna take it on my finger and I'm just gonna start pressing this in the inner parts of the eye where I put over mint julep. I'm just gonna like press it. And now I'm gonna take a the same brush I use for the primer, I'm going to take a concealer and I'm going to clean this up. And yeah, I'm going to focus myself on the lower lash line and then we're going to apply the studs. Okay, and on the lower lash line, it's the same thing going on. So I'm going to keep doing that. I'm going to take Jaded from the Milani palette and just line it up underneath. I'm going to take Mint Julep in the beginning and just pack this on. And then I'm going to take that same blue on the same brush and just pack... Oh, oh fuck. Did anybody see that? And just pack... Oh, oh fuck. I don't know what y'all... Ah! You better stop! Stop! Oh my god, I have eyeshadow on my eye. Fuck. <laughs> Oh my god, can I go blind? I hope I got that. That would be so funny. Okay, oh. Uh. Well, that's that. Did I die for makeup? Sure thing. Oh my god. Anyways, um. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna come back and do the other eye. So, the easiest way for me to do this. Um, is by using tweezers and lash glue. So that's what I'm going to do today. Um, I'm just going to go back to the reference picture. And so in the beginning right here, um, it's the mini, mini, mini studs. And then it goes into like the medium size studs. So I'm going to be using all the medium size studs that I have left and all the mini studs I have left. So it's going to be a mixture of both. Hopefully I have enough for each eye. I might not, so I'm gonna have to use a, some bigger one. Okay, so I'm gonna start by just lining up the outline of this crease by just adding some lash glue all over the inner part of this look. So I'm not going to extend it outwards yet, all the way over there, because I want to see how many it takes to get this part done. So I'm going to start taking some of the miniature studs, and I'm just going to hope for the best.
All right, so I'm gonna apply some glue in these areas and then just reapply. Okay, so I'm going to take the Anastasia Loose Highlighter in Vegas and I'm going to put this all over my cheekbones because I want to highlight really nicely today. Um, what time is it? It's almost time to take my picture, so I'm like, huh. All right, so I'm going to take it across my cheekbones and just go ham with it. So I'm going to take uh, my Anastasia Contour Kit. I haven't used this in so long. But um, I'm going to take Fawn. I'm going to take Fawn and uh, this shade as well. Oh no, Fawn and Java, I believe. And I'm just going to lightly take this into my contour of my face. Just for some depth into my face. And then I'm going to start with the lips. So today I'm going to be using the Anastasia Liquid Lipstick in Ashton. I'm going to take this and overline my lips kind of because Maddie has overlined lips. So yeah. I'm just really overlining my cupid's bow like just a little bit. Okay. And then I'm going to take this Milani... A more satin matte in lavish so this is the lightest one in the collection I'm gonna take this into the center like so and just go like this and then I'm going to blend out this with my fingers so this is pretty much what she wears. I feel like I just got plastic surgery, you know? Um, I'm gonna start to apply my lashes because they've been sitting here for a while and I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. And I need to take my pictures, so... I'm gonna let my lashes sit on my eyes for a little bit before I start pressing my lash my real lashes and my fake lashes together fix my hair a little bit off camera but yeah i'm almost done with the look and now i'm gonna press my lashes together so nobody clocks me this time i know how to apply lashes okay <sighs> the one video the one video that gets a little bit of attention and i have a really bad eyelash on my right eye and i was pissed pissed when I looked at the footage. Honestly, I'm still hurt. I was really disrespected and betrayed by my eyelash. Um, <sighs> wow. My bed is a mess because I have so much makeup on it and I have to clean it up. Thank you guys so much for watching and tuning in to this video. The fact that you guys actually like watching my content is like really uh, just like a weight lifted off of my shoulders, but um, yeah. Oh, it's getting hot. Oh, Jesus. I hope this video was helpful in I hope that you guys can try this look out. It is a little time consuming, but I'm pretty sure you guys can do it. I mean, I mean, you guys can do it. I know and I believe that you guys can do it. But yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. You can click right here to see uh, a previous video that I posted. I posted a few uh, so far from the Euphoria series and go watch, just click. Have a good one. Bye.